do it. Hey guys, this is Versatile from UC Power, now hosted on the Money Things channel. In today's video game tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can properly transfer your PS2 games over to your USB hard drive using a program called USB Util 2.0. Uh, first things first, make sure that one thing you want to do is if you go into Administrative Tools, which is located under Control Panel, find your USB hard drive or your disk partition if you're going to use the network method, for example. And once you find your disk, what you want to do is make sure that your partition is let me just take out my USB hard drive and uh, put it plug it back in here one of the things you want to do is make sure that your partition is a primary and also active so if I maximize this window here here's my disk so it says active and primary partition great that's exactly what we want okay so next thing we want to do is um, make sure it's formatted properly so one of the things that I like to do first is if I go to my computer here right click format Format is NTFS, okay? Once you do that, go ahead and run your USB Extreme program. So let's go ahead and find my program real quick here, USB Extreme. You might need to run it as admin, so let me go ahead and run that as admin. I won't do the format process because I already did it once already, and it does take a while, a couple minutes here. I'm trying to save some time. But click on Disk Format, click on Format, find your PS2 hard drive partition. Make sure you do the right partition. Here for me is the letter J. I don't know what it is for you, but just double check it. Click OK, and then it's going to go ahead and format that partition. Once that partition is already formatted, now we're ready to start ripping games to that USB hard drive. So once again, let's go ahead, let's get my USB util program. And I'll just run this. You go to the Marvel section, I got links where you could download a copy of both of these programs. And I go to File. So you can either create a game from ISO or you can open the game list. So I already ripped some games to my USB hard drive. So let's go ahead and open that game list first. So I'm going to go here, go to my J drive, ul.cfg, load it, and I ripped two example games here. So let's rip some more games, for example. So if I go to File, Create Game from ISO. If you had a, a PS2 disc mounted, for example, or in your DVD drive or Blu-ray drive, you can also rip it too. But I have an ISO file on my hard drive, so let's go ahead and create Game from ISO. And let me just go to my one of my um, folders here. And let's try Sky Gunner. And click on, oh, over here on the right-hand side, just make sure you have your PS2 hard drive partition selected. And then click on Create. You don't have to do anything else here. I don't do any patching. Um, some other people might do patching. I think that's more related to online play. If for whatever reason your game doesn't work, I suppose you can investigate the patch options. Now, granted, not every single USB game is going to work. Okay, so the best advice I can give you if you're interested in USB game playing is just rip your games and just test it and see if it works. If your game is frozen on a colored screen when you're using Open PS2 Loader, for example, try defragging your hard drive, defrag your game, and maybe, maybe it works. And if it doesn't, then time to move on to a different game. Okay, so we're almost done with the creation here. Um... Yeah, it's done. Excellent. And let's say you want to rename something. So like Virtual Fighter 4 Evolution, I don't like the way it's displayed. So I can click on rename. I could say VF4, you know, as an example. You know, Marvel vs. Capcom 2. I could rename it as Marvel vs. Capcom 2. You know, something like that. And then uh, that's pretty much it. So I go File, Close UL, and then you're good to go. You want to double check it, just do the same thing. Open it. So if your hard drive is formatted correctly, just like this video, you plug into your soft modded or hard modded PS2, load your favorite you know, USB loading program like OpenPS2 Loader, and if you do it right, you should see your list of games, and hopefully your games are compatible, and you can play it on your PS2. So that is today's video game tutorial. You guys have any nitpicky questions, leave a comment here on, US, on the YouTube page, and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Once again, thank you for watching. Take care. Bye.